we got some are back in the channel and we got some Filipino food. Authentic Filipino food. Yes, because you guys wanted us to try it, so we're trying it. Yeah. And then we it took us two videos because we went to two places closer to where we live and the food wasn't as authentic as we thought. It didn't feel authentic because it was like a fusion place. And then we and then we went to Jollibee yeah. and one of the people there oh. said you should try this place. This is like oh my God, the most authentic place. I've seen where I live, where she we live. She said it's like her favorite. Yes. Ooh. See something poking right there. So we got a, a lot of stuff. Yeah. Obviously we won't be able to finish it. We're going to eat it later. We have two... What do you say this were? Sinigang. Oh, they gave us two? Is it two? What no, is that? different. Oh, maybe that's the kare kare. Oh, yeah, I think it's the kare kare. Here, I think I have the ticket here. Let me see. Oh, yeah, the spaghetti. That oh I, had to, God, I had to get so this because it looks so good. We have the porch to see. Which one is it? Is this one? Is it? No, this is... This is... This is the... Um, oh, my God. How do you call this? So, how do you call this? I forgot. This is the... The, the adobo. Ch adobo chicken. This is the chicken adobo. We have the halo halo, which is gonna be trying first so it doesn't melt. And then we have sinigang. Yes. Pork sisi, kare kare, palabok. Yes. Y and that's it. I realized a lot of stuff, a lot of Filipino stuff. Kind of that looks sound, so good. Sound the same as Spanish. Yeah. The spaghetti looks like amazing. I don't know if y'all say carne, but when I was looking at the menu, it said carne with a K. And like lechon, longaniza. Yeah. Okay. Oh, look at that Tesla. Oh. Let's try the halo oh, halo first. You gotta mix it. Everything. The place looks really good. Can you mix it? Like it looks so good. The restaurant. Yeah. What is this? The rice? We have a lot of rice. I don't know if I'm mixing this the right way. Please don't condemn me. Just like no no no. You have to like no 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 but like like, like what? wrap it around like I gotta like, spill. Yeah, like I don't know if I'm doing this right. I wanna try it though. Mmm. Oh my god, it's so good. It's not as sweet as the one that we tried the other day. In a good way. You gotta get everything. Mmm. You gotta get everything at the bottom too. It's cause it's one and rich base. What is everything that's in there? Is it like jello? Okay, okay, I'll go something. Mm. I'm trying to like get everything up in there. Oh, something down there is good. Okay. Um, if there's air conditioning sound, it's because the camera turns off by itself. So please, yeah, watch the ads so we can buy a new camera. <laughs> okay, grab the fish. Fish? Where's the fish? This is the fried. Oh my god, I just dirty all my shit. The fried milk fish? That's what they told me it was called. Okay. Now let's try this food. I'm gonna try this. I wanna try this so bad. It looks so good. I wanna try the pot book. Get an egg in there. Mmm. God. It kind of tastes, it, it tastes different than Jollibee in a good way. This tastes similar to something I've had before. You know what? We have something in Haiti that tastes just like this.
Oh my god, it's so good. You wanna switch? No. Oh my god, this is so good. It's better than the Jollibee? It just seems more homemade. Try it, try it. Mm. Some water here. It's good. Mmm. Mmm. I'm definitely messing with this. See, you didn't want to get it. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Right? I knew I would like it. I just didn't want it because noodles make you full really quick. I bet I got also taste these before. Right? Why? I didn't really like the Jolly Bee probably well. This tastes nothing like the Jolly Bee one, I think. Mm -hmm. You're supposed to put like lemon? Lime. Let's try it. Do you put lime on everything lime. in the Philippines? Because I can get down with that. Oh my god, the temperature. It's happening again. Fuck you, Sony. I hate your cameras. Yeah. Ooh. With the lime, is really good. But this shit right here. Just don't be nervous. If it turns off, it turns off. Yeah. Oh my god, this is like amazing. I want to try this. This looks so good. It's so saucy too. This is the milkfish. I don't know what it's called. In I want to try it without like anything first. It's fried milkfish. Yeah. Oh my god, it's so good. Mmm. Is it? That's good. Oh. Mm. Thank God it doesn't taste like milk. It sounds scary. Mm? It sounds scary. Yeah, but I'm sure. I want to try the other one. What is the? Why is it called milkfish? Like, what is the relation to milk? Is it like marinated in milk and then fried? I know that's something that they do. Oh no, this looks Our amazing. Country. I don't want to spill it, but oh my goodness, the oh my juices God. smell it. And then we have rice over here, because I want to eat this with rice. Okay, open the rice. Oh my God, I'm full already. No, I can still eat. Okay. Um, what the fuck do I do this? It's so like oh, the fish is so good. Juicy, juicy. I could order I could order just this. Let me put it. This might be like the thing I order now. Oh Okay. We have a spoon with There you go. Mmm. No, you're gonna love this. You're gonna love this. Oh my I can't stop eating the fish. This is so good. I love fish so much. <laughs> to a fault. Mm. Mm. I dropped the fish. <laughs> oh my god. No the juices in this adobo, the chicken is so good. <laughs> I lost some fish. Okay, let me not overindulge myself. 
And the chicken, the chicken is so tender, like you can just break it apart. But you need to eat it with some rice, you know. Oh my, that's so good. Oh, what is this? Like, I don't know what these juices have. All this sauce, but like it's so good. Look at that bite. You see how juicy it is? Oh my god. You need to try this. With rice. I'm gonna prepare you a bite. Prepare me a bite. Make the chicken. I can grab some chicken. Bring on. Chicken. Give mm -hmm. me a little bit of the sauce. Mm -hmm. Grab some rice with it. Good. You like it? Uh huh. I'm already building the rankings in my head. Right now, the fish is number one for me. Did you try the fish? Mm hmm. It was good, right? Like, the fish is number one for me. Spaghetti is always going to be number one, but the um, adobo, adobo is right there. I think fish mm -hmm. number one right now, spaghetti is number two right now. No, you don't like the adobo that much? I didn't get enough of it. But like... It's so good. I'm thinking about stuff that I could eat like non-stop. Like the fish, if I can't stop eating it, I know it's, I like it. If I can't stop eating it, I know I like it. This is the sisig. Ooh. With the fried egg on top. Oh my god, that adobo! No, oh, it smells a little spicy. I think the adobo is the, first, the my my top one. I need I need some napkin. Never mind. Have this. No, I I would say my favorite is the adobo one for now. But we still have two like little stewed soup things. Yeah. I'm gonna put some lime on this. Oh my god, it's so good. But I need to try more stuff first. What you put the napkin? Here. Okay, let's try this. We have it over here. Oh, I'm gonna try this. Try it, try it, try it. I think Sissig is pork ears. That's what it said on the menu. I don't wanna like make it fall. Ask me one spoon. It's just really hot. This is how it looks like. I don't know what did you say this was? Sinegang? Sinegang? I know I'm gonna burn myself with you know what the thing is? It uses like mostly cartilage, right? Yeah. You don't like that? I don't like cartilage. I love cartilage. So you probably like this. But like, I'm Did not a big fan of cartilage. That's well, not cartilage. No, bro, you just try it, try it. Move. Like, what do you give me? I gave you a little piece. I like the texture. I'm a big texture guy. And I'm not really a fan of like cartilage texture. But I could see the appeal. Oh my god, this is so hot. I need help. Stop, like slow. It smells amazing though. Okay. Hurry up, I'm literally burning it so. Are you supposed to eat it with rice? I don't know. Let me try this soup first. Oh 
Oh my god. What? Holy. I was not expecting that, like, at all. How is this clear broth? Like, how is this clear broth that tasty? There's no way. There's so much flavor. What the fuck? What is this? Is this like yucca or something? It's like citrusy. Very fresh and citrusy. Mm-hmm. Oh my goodness. How do you make the like a clear broth so tasty? What is that flavor though? It's like lemony. Ooh, it's lemony. I think it's lemony. It's so good. Is that octopus? No, bro, that's not octopus. What is it? It's like a vegetable or something. Like a, a vegetable that looks like octopus in a way. Let me try to search it up. What it is? Oh my god, this is so good. This is at the top too. I love soap. Oh, I'm definitely drinking this tonight. Yeah. Oh my goodness, it's like that perfect like flavoring. It might be like a perfect soup, a perfect broth. Right? It's so good. We're not exaggerating, okay? Sauce. You want to talk about that thing? Oh, one thing that we wanted to talk about was I was doing a lot of research on um, when we were searching up Filipino food and what to eat. I found something called Filipino baiting. And I'm sure a lot of Filipino people watching this video would probably know what it is. And it's not something that we want to come off as we're doing. We don't want to seem like we're exploding the culture. Like we're genuinely interested in like trying other cultures foods like we try a bunch of different other countries foods and we don't want to seem like we're just using you guys for like views or like recognition like it's not something that we want to do and it was highly requested from y'all so we want to do it for y'all but if y'all don't want any more videos of filipino stuff after this like it's completely understandable we don't and want like, to we come literally, that way at all we generally like this food like we eat jollibee on a not daily basis, but we eat jelly with a lot of camera. It's we like a 40 minute drive, but we still eat a lot. Like, we do a 40 minute drive to go to Jollibee like multiple times. And before we even posted about it, we would go like a bunch of times. And then if this was close to my house, I am not joking. I would get this stuff like daily. Yeah. I'm not exaggerating. Like, I want you guys to know that like we're not ex- exaggerating. And then people are sleeping on like this Filipino hoop. This, this soup. I'm like shocked. I'm trying to read what it is. I don't understand about. how how do you guys see how clear this broth is? It is like the most tasteful broth I have ever tasted in my entire life. It's insane. Oh my goodness. What? Maybe we're eating it wrong. Maybe. I don't care, it's so good like this. But that's how I eat most of my soups. I just eat the broth. Oh my god, it's so good. I'm trying to find out what that thing is. Let me try it with some rice. Can you? We had a lot of it. Like, it was full to the top, and look. You make so much vibes. You're eating. A little bit of rice. A little bit of broth. Mm. That's the goodness. That's pretty good. I'm trying to find the menu. Okay. What is in Sinigang? It doesn't say here. Just Google it. Sinigang pork cooked in tamarind broth with vegetables. Maybe it's tamarind. tamarind. I don't know. I don't know what that is, but I want to bath on that. The sisig is grilled pork ears. I don't think I like it. Karekare. Karekare is oxtail 
in peanut sauce. Beef stew in peanut Ooh, sauce. That sounds too. really good. Can you? Um, okay. This, we we have, have. This is the kare kare? Yes. I need, to, I need you, you to help me open it. Yes. Oh, it's like a some sort of like, I'll say chili, but maybe I'm wrong, so I don't know. Some type of paste. Yeah. Let's leave it on the bark. Just. What's going on? These whistles. I think it was a bird. There's a bird right there. You see it? Oh. There's a bird oh, this looks, watching us. This looks very interesting. I, mean, I, I want you guys to see how it looks. Oh, it smells peanutty. You see? Do you smell the peanut? Oh, what? You want to drop the soup? Oh, it kind of it smells like the sauce for the spring, summer rolls in the you know the spring rolls the Vietnamese spring rolls summer rolls no spring rolls the Vietnamese summer rolls. It smells just peanutty. Cause the the oh, it's like a a stew. It is a stew. Let me try them these green beans. I'm gonna try with some rice. This is my bite. Oh, you fuck. This is my bite for the moment. Mm. Oh. Very, very peanutty. That's good though. I'm trying to get to the meat though. Is there meat? But nothing beats the other broth. The other broth? No, the other broth is like, it's hard to. I love oxtail though. Mmm. Good? Really tender. <gasps> I'm sorry. Give me the Mmm. Mm. Like good. I don't know what I like more. No, the fish is number one for Everything me. Everything is so good. The fish is number one for me. I think the broth is number one for me. The, um, not the broth, the um, Senegal, right? <laughs> it's called Senegal, right? Senegang. Senegang. Yes. Uh, it's amazing. Okay. What are the ratings? Let me do my rankings. Number one for sure. For sure, for sure. And let me get her out here so she's not lonely. He loves the fish. The milk fish. Oh my goodness. I didn't even try it with the sauce that they gave us. But I kind of honestly don't want to. But this. This is number one for me. Let See me my the boy? Price. You say I'm number one. No, this is like I need my mama to make me this. Number two, synagogue. Number three. Damn. Number three, spaghetti. Number four. You need to try this again, I think, because you. I Number four, it's adobo. Chicken adobo. You need to try it again. But it's like, it's chicken, like. No, it's not just chicken. It's just like the broth. But it's very rich. Oh, I love that. I get like, if I have too much richness, I get full quick. But the spaghetti is like really childhood, nostalgic for me. So that would have to be number three. Chicken and one number four. Palawak number five. Got it, got it, number six. Are you kidding me? Look at these. Like, I would have to put the Sisig at number seven. Just because of a personal like preference of mine. Because like I just don't like the texture of cartilage. But I understand the appeal. So it's my turn? It's your turn for the rankings. Okay. First, Sinegang. Okay. For sure. I can respect, I, I can respect And that. I need to see buddy right now. Like this. Please let me know if I'm eating it wrong. But this, I love soup. And I don't think I've ever, oh. in my... Who are these people? You better walk past. I'm nervous. 
Why is he just looking at us? You can't have none. You gotta go. <laughs> I'm dead. Okay, so this is first, and like I this every time I sip on it, it surprises me. I love soup, and I've never tried a broth so flavorful in my entire life. I need to know how to make these. Oh it's behind goodness. us again. Let me get some more now. Oh. The fish is like, it just makes a hole in your stomach and you just keep eating. Second, I think the second place is adobo, chicken adobo. And it takes a lot for me to put the spaghetti in third place because I love the spaghetti. But I think the chicken adobo is more surprising. Okay. I love like gravy, like rich, like meaty, like sauces with chicken and like rice. Oh my god, amazing. And then the, the spaghetti is third. The, the, you have some? The, um, the oxtail four place no where are you gonna put the fish last why i didn't like it that much oh my god it was so good maybe i'm not a fishy person okay oxtail fourth palabok fifth and i think fish and palabok are like kind of tied it's not everything is good like i will eat it yeah no the only thing i wouldn't get again is this is sick because Oh, I didn't even rain this to see. I didn't like it that much either. I like the texture, but it's like um I don't like the texture. I'm just not I'm not a cartilage person. I did. I'm more of like a I don't know, my rank is a little bit like I don't I forgot. The halo halo too. I I don't know, it's too stuff. The halo halo is it's like that's the dessert rankings. We got only one dessert. It's number one in the dessert rankings. The the flam part? Oh my god. Goodness, that like, both part was amazing. Spaghetti is just like. I'm gonna fuck come out again. Okay, so you have Sinigang 1, Adobo 2, Spaghetti 3, um, Kare Kare 4. <laughs> I can think. Palabok and Fish tied for 5th. Mm. Then you have the. What else? You have the sisig at six. Everything in this spaghetti works perfectly. The sweet, the sweet and it's like salty sauce with the meat and the sausage and the cheese and the spaghetti. Mm -hmm. Oh my god! I wish I could rate the sisig more fairly, but like the way I grew up, if there was like cartilage or something like. I didn't like it. I didn't want to eat it. But I wish I could rate it more fairly. I love the cartilage. Like, if you give me a chicken wing, I will eat the cartilage of the wing. I can't do that. Like, no, not a wing, a drumstick. can't do that. My, my mom can do that. That's my can't favorite that. part. That, like, white part at the top, and I, oh my goodness, so crunchy and good. But it's like a gelatinous crunchy. Mm mm. You know what I'm saying? Like a gelatinous crunchy. It's like if you could bite, like, bite into the bone. Yeah. But what I really love is like the variation. With, with a lot of like American food, it's just like the same thing over and over. Like the same type of meat, the same type of like cut of the meat over and over. But I like that they like fully commit to like, if you like cartilage, here's the sick. If you like the whole fish, here's the whole fish. I'm surprised. It's really abnormal here to have like the whole fish, but in uh, almost every other country, like they'll serve it to you the whole fish. It's not normal here? No, it's not normal. Really? I, I used to eat the eyeballs growing up. My grandma put me into it. And I'm gonna lie to you, I haven't eaten it in years. 
but the eye will hit. Like, they hit. I'm sorry if it sounds disgusting, but they just hit. They're good as fuck. If you ever see a fish, they're like, oh, you could eat the eyeballs. Try it once. Maybe it's disgusting to you, but I swear it's good. Like, mm -hmm. it's really Have you tried it? Um, maybe once. It's so good. Did it taste like something to you? Huh? I think the time I tried it, it didn't taste like anything. It's really good. We had like most of the broth, but didn't eat anything inside. Is that bad? That's pretty much it. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If there's more stuff that you guys want to see, please let us know in the comments down below. I need the recipe to that broth. Like, I just, I need it. Yeah. It's not a joke. But, I have dermatologist. Like we have a dermatologist appointment to get to, so I gotta drive fast. <laughs> um, but yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed it. If you ever want to make milkfish for me one day, please let me know. <laughs> I'm so tired. I can't even talk. But this was amazing. Like, no, that am... thing is quenching. The synagogue is quenching. Wait, what was it? The beginning of that again? Yeah. No, for real. I forgot. I don't know. I don't feel like talking about it. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so tired. I, there's something about Filipino food that always puts me in a food coma in a good way. Like, I, I'm always just happy after I eat. But, um, I, much I'm amazed but by how much flavor all this stuff has. Oh, yeah. I'm really, really amazed. And this restaurant is really good. Because this compared to the other restaurant. Yeah. This one was called Manila Grill. And barbecue. Manila Grill and barbecue. And this was... <laughs> Let's just end the video. This was amazing. I am amazed by everything. The spaghetti, amazing. I I still love Jollibee, but this spaghetti, man. The chicken adobo. Yeah. Like, I need to eat that every day. How do I make it? And I ain't gonna lie to you, we're gonna eat all this. Because it's so good. I can't. I need no, to yeah, have we're it taking all this home. Like, I need to eat it at night. And then... The synagogue gun? Yes. I feel like I'm like drunk right now. <laughs> Do you feel like that? No. The synagogue is amazing. Like out of this world. This this shit had alcohol, bro. I'm so I feel drunk. <clears throat> no, it does not have alcohol. Well That's pretty much and it. Look how my rice we have left to eat it all oh, tonight. We don't have to make rice. Tonight. Well, that's pretty much it. Now I need to go get my team. <laughs> so, oh my goodness. I'm, sorry, I'm, sorry. I'm gonna end the video before it gets out of control. <laughs> but thank y'all for watching. I love y'all. I Goodbye. love you. Bye.